Good evening. My name is Althea Ito, and on this day 128, in recognition of Black History Month, we would like to commemorate American Revolutionary War hero, Crispus Attucks. A former slave and ship dock worker at the Boston Harbor, Attucks' claim to fame is being the first person to give his life in pursuit of freedom for his country. During the colonial days, the main method of transportation for goods between the colonies and the rest of the world centered at the shipping docks, making it a hub of economic importance. Most of the revenues generated by trade were unfairly taxed by the British government overseas. While colonists were angered by the presence of British soldiers in their cities, it was not uncommon for demonstrations and unrest to happen, especially at the Boston docks where Crispus Attucks worked. As a result, British soldiers were stationed at the Boston Harbor in an attempt to control the ever-growing colonial unrest. On March 5, 1770, a group of townspeople led by Attucks demonstrated against the British occupation of the Boston Harbor. Tension mounted rapidly. What started out as col colonists simply throwing snowballs turned out to be a violent confrontation. It went from a snowball fight to sticks and stones. It is believed that Crispus Attucks threw a wooden club at the soldier, striking him. British troops fired their muskets, killing three of the Americans instantly and mortally wounding two others. Attucks was struck twice and was the first to fall, thus becoming the first man to lose his life in the cause of American independence. The event was known as the Boston Massacre, which eventually led to the Revolutionary War and ultimately American freedom. Attucks became a symbol for African-American activists in the abolitionist movement who promoted him as an example of a hero and a patriot. A memorial is established at the Boston Commons honoring the, the five fallen people who died during the Boston Massacre.